Hello, honey. Caught your fish. Just a little bass. Just a tiny little guy. Cute though. There's another little bass. Cute little guy. Bucket mouth miniature. Jeez, old pieces, did you see that? No. <laughs> this thing hanging right here. Yeah, uh, I don't know if it was a bass or a perch came up, and took it right there, almost took my rod in the water. Just like that. I'm not even sure I got it there. Let's see if I can get it on video, this silly little fish. It's got to be bluegill. Well, they're not going to do it again now that I'm recording. They were out in the canoe on, on the, I think they were on the, on the, on the, on the Grand River in Lansing. And the swan came over. Hello, swan. Goodbye, swan. There we go, a little better. Paddles in my way, that figures. A little bit bigger. Maybe 12, 13 inches. Not huge, but I beaked him with that uh, orange jig head. Not bad. Let me get him up in the air here for breath. Um, back in the air. Shout out, limited buddies. Well, here we are. Thompson Lake. June, uh, what is it, 18th? June 18, yeah. June 18. Bradley and I got the kayaks out. We haven't really gone that far from where we launched, but we've caught probably between us, I'd say, at least a half a dozen bass and a handful of bluegills, maybe a couple perch. Bradley is sporting the 12 foot ultimate kayak I've got the brand new 12 foot wilderness systems that I just picked up thank you Craigslist for 150 bucks can't complain and uh, we're both shooting out here with our St. Croix reel rods and our Fluger reels and I didn't know better I'd say we were equipped similarly because we have similar tastes but anyway this river or this river this lake is something else because it's uh, obviously it's a speed boaters paradise but hey we're catching fish we're having fun it's good to spend some time out on the water <laughs>